Welcome to Marvel TLDR, the series where we break down Marvel's greatest stories so you can jump right in and read the original adventures. Today's story is Doctor Strange, The Oath. Stephen Strange was once the world's greatest surgeon, but also an arrogant jerk. Although he could save practically anybody's life that needed it, Stephen only tended to the wealthiest of clients. But then, on one fateful night, Stephen got into a terrible car wreck. A surgeon named Nicodemus West managed to save his life, but Stephen's hands were damaged beyond repair. Refusing to give up on his career, Stephen traveled to the Himalayas in search of a cure for his hands. It's there that he meets a powerful sorcerer called the Ancient One. And through the course of his training, Stephen grew to be a better man and a powerful sorcerer, eventually earning the title of Sorcerer Supreme. Nicodemus also came to the Ancient One shortly after Doctor Strange had finished his training. You see, Nicodemus felt terrible about not being able to fix Stephen's hands, and so he wanted to find Stephen and try to fix his hands again. The Ancient One decided to train Nicodemus in the ways of magic as well, but Nicodemus was too impatient and left before his training was complete. Nicodemus tried to use magic to heal his patients, but accidentally made his first patient explode. He decided to turn himself into the authorities, but members of the evil Timely Pharmaceutical Company convinced him to give up magic and work for them instead. Dead. We jump to the present day. Doctor Strange learns that his assistant and close friend Wong has late stage brain cancer. To save him, Doctor Strange travels to another dimension where he fights a hideous cat god who guards a bottle of magical elixir that might be the cure for cancer. However, before he can give it to Wong, the elixir is stolen by a thief named Brigand, and he shoots Doctor Strange with a magical gun that once belonged to Hitler. Wong takes Steven to the Night Nurse, a physician in a cape who secretly treats superheroes for free. During the operation, Doctor Strange leaves his own body as an astral projection and tells her about the stolen cure. He also acts as a ghostly backseat surgeon. I guess it's true what they say about doctors making the worst patients. Wong and Doctor Strange are both in bad shape, so the Night Nurse decides to help them get the cure back. They track down Brigand and discover that Nicodemus West, who is now the CEO of Timely Pharmaceuticals, was the person who hired him. Doctor Strange has a psychic battle with Brigand inside of his brain, and then he imprisons Brigand in his own mind is punishment. Later, Nicodemus burns down Night Nurse's office by summoning a giant demon tentacle monster. Doctor Strange kills the monster using Brigand's magic Hitler gun. And then, Strange, Wong, and the nurse all go to confront Nicodemus. Nicodemus reveals that the elixir is panacea, the fabled cure for all diseases in the world. Brigand had stolen it for Nicodemus, so Doctor Strange couldn't put the entire medical profession out of business by replicating the elixir. Nicodemus runs away to destroy the panacea, but Doctor Strange chases him. Nicodemus runs away again, but Doctor Strange chases him again. Tired of running, Nicodemus casts a spell that stops all magic for three minutes. The two doctors face off and then start kung fu fighting on a rainy rooftop. Nicodemus falls off the roof, dropping most of the panacea into a sewer once he hits the ground. With a single drop of panacea left, Stephen Strange has to make a terrible choice. Should he use the elixir to save Wong, who is about to die immediately? Or should he allow his friend to die and create enough medicine to save the whole world? Doctor Strange decides to save his friend. With Wong cured, Night Nurse finds evidence that will incriminate Timely's board of directors and she sends it to the government. And then, Doctor Strange and Night Nurse kiss. Because a dude who would sacrifice the whole world for one person might just be prime smooching material. Thanks for watching this video. Read the original Doctor Strange The Oath storyline on Marvel Unlimited, on the Marvel Comics app, or in Graphic Novel Edition wherever comics are sold.